Consider an example now. The modulating signal 20 cos 2 pi into 10 raised to 3 t is used to modulate a carrier signal 40 cos 2 pi into 10 raised to 4 t. Find the modulation index percentage modulation, frequencies of sideband components and their amplitudes. What is the bandwidth of the modulated signal? We have EM equals 20 cos 2 pi into 10 raised to 3 t. EC equals 40 cos 2 pi into 10 raised to 40. We need to find modulation index M, percentage modulation, frequency of upper side band and frequency of lower side band. For that, we use standard equations of modulating signal and carrier signal and the formula M equals EM upon EC and bandwidth is equal to 2 into FM. The standard equation for modulating signal is EM equals EM cos omega MT. The equation of the modulating signal is EM equals 20 cos 2 pi into 10 raised to 2t. On comparing, we get EM equals 20, omega equals 2 pi into 10 raised to 2, thus FM equals 1000 hertz. The standard equation of carrier signal is EC equals EC cos omega CT. And the given equation is EC equals 40 cos 2 pi into 10 raised to 40. On comparing the two equations, we get EC equals 20, omega M equals 2 pi into 10 raised to 4 into T, thus FC equals 10,000 Hz, equals 10 kilohertz. The modulation index is calculated as ratio of EM to EC and comes out to be equal to 0 0.5. Thus, percentage modulation becomes 50%. The upper side band frequency equals carrier frequency plus modulating frequency equals 11 kilohertz and lower sideband frequency equals carrier frequency minus modulating signal frequency equals 9 kHz. The amplitudes of each sidebands are MEC by 2 equal to 10 volts. And the bandwidth requires is 2 into FM equals 2 kHz.